Mike Brown Sestero with AV Nation. We're here at DSE 2022 with Henry Ambrose from Infolet. Henry, how are you? Doing well, thanks, Mike. Welcome to DSE. It's been about four years since the last DSE, and it was a little bit different, but it's a little bit same, same now. And this is your first time exhibiting, am I correct? It is. We're excited to be a part of DSE. Got it. How's the traffic been? How's the show been? The show opened with a bang. Uh, it was quite busy. We were knee deep in, uh, in people. Uh, talking to a lot of interesting people about projects that uh, they had up and coming. So it was a great start, great kickoff. And if the folks watching this at home were here at DSC today and they came by the InfoLED booth, what would they look at? Well, they'd be marveling at our uh, 4K uh, native 3840 by 2160 WT display, which is a flip chip COB. So it's uh, perfect for very close proximity, high touch environments. It's our uh, flagship product being displayed here. Uh, we also have our WP Arc, which is a 1.56 okay. uh, millimeter display in a convex uh, application. We also do concave and can do custom angles uh, on the product in a, a Got it, so you're curve. not just a flat provider anymore. You're doing the curves both right, ways. Right, right, we, uh, we can do both convex and concave and custom. Uh, applications uh, to, to any degree or angle that's, uh, that's desired. And then we're also, just for fun, uh, displaying our Infa Banner, which is uh, an LED strip uh, with a matrix of, of display of LEDs on the display. Um, great use for tickers, stairs, any place where you need to accentuate uh, a space with some video. Got it. And let me ask you a question. A lot of folks uh, sometimes get a little bit nervous about using custom aspect ratios, custom size, custom shape screens, because now obviously your content has to be created with that in mind. Does InfoLED offer some support to the content creator or the end user about how to best use the InfoLED product? Sure. Uh, every display application has its unique requirements and it may not necessarily be a native 16 by 9 display. Right. Uh, but you want, might want a ticker, you might want a ban banner, you might want some you know, creative shape. Um, anything that can be rendered into a window on a computer is how you would render uh, a usable, simple content. Also, custom content can, can be created and mapped onto a display in any way, uh, shape, or form. But we'd be happy to help Got people it. out with that. And if folks are looking to find out more about InfoLED or perhaps get in touch with you all for some of that custom support, where do they go? Yep, well, you can meet us at uh, www.infoled.com and uh, find us on Twitter and uh, Facebook and uh, all of the no normal socials. All um, the socials out there in the world? Yeah, we're out there. Thank you so much, Henry. Appreciate your time. Welcome to DSE. Great. Thanks, Mike. Happy to be here. Mike Brown Sestero for AV Nation. If you want to find out more about InfoLED, you can certainly go to their website, but you can also go to avnation.tv.